fishing in grass with a frog. That's a great thing to be doing, isn't it? Working very well right now. What about speed? What's your best speed for fishing that frog in the grass? Good morning, guys and girls. August 27, August 27, reading from the book of Psalm, reading from a Catch a Better Life book. This is our Catch a Better Life book. Took me a couple years to write. We have a Catch a Better Life YouTube channel. If you're not subscribed to that YouTube channel, go in there and subscribe right now. It's absolutely free. It doesn't cost a penny. And uh, we post a devotional built around fishing, a scripture from the God's Word, and a fishing tip for every single day, 365 days a year, post at 5 o'clock in the morning, Central Time. If you are already subscribed, share this with 20 or 30 of your friends and tell them to get on there. It's the most important channel on YouTube. Just my opinion. <laughs> Psalm 46.1 says, God is our refuge and our strength. A very present help in trouble. God is our refuge and strength. A very present help in trouble. Here's what I wrote about that. We all have certain go-to baits and tactics when things don't go just right on the water. I actually have several. <laughs> and how I use them depends on whether I'm just fun fishing, out there having a great time, I'm tournament fishing, or we are making a television show. Might be a small jig and worm, what they call a shaky head, or a Ned rig today. Might be a spinnerbait. A lot of times it is a spinnerbait. It might be point hopping. He's taking off and fishing point after point after point after point with a variety of baits. I might even change lakes. <laughs> Can't do that in tournaments, but I can sure change lakes when we're filming television shows. Some anglers just quit when things go wrong. Don't quit. Don't quit. For goodness sakes, don't quit. Today's little verse sums up a lot to me. When things don't go right in life, we need a place of safety, we need a refuge. That's God, and that's God's Word. God and His Word is our place of safety, our place of refuge. And while we're there in God's Word, those words will encourage us, they'll make us stronger, and as that trouble becomes weaker and less of a problem, but here's the biggie. God is at work all the time helping us solve that problem. Our God is bigger than any problem that we may have. And your problem will get smaller and smaller. He's doing things right now, setting up situations that we've never dreamed of. Things that we never even crossed our mind God's working on right now. And at just at the right time, God's never late. Just at the right time, our trouble's gone. And like Hank Parker told me one time, I've said this before, Jimmy, a thousand years from now, it won't make any difference. It won't matter what your trouble is right now, a thousand years from now will not make any difference. Here is our uh, tip for this week in grass. If you're going to be fishing a song, frog, it's better to fish frogs really, really slow. Now, sometimes you can wind them through their top. The fish are very aggressive. They might get them, but the slower, the better, generally generally good rule of thumb in fishing with a frog and it's a great thing to be using right now you want to have a plastic worm laying there with a uh, with a worm on it so when a fish blows up if he missed that frog you can throw right back in there and hit that spot where he missed many times you'll catch that fish it's a very very good backup bait a plastic worm when you're frog fishing make sure you will have one handy guys and girls go out there and have you a great one today and remember i sure do love you